Our library is now richer for some amazing navigation menus. They are all part of our latest collection, Ragnar. Check it out if you haven't already, you can find them all in the layout finder tab of our plugins dashboard. They are all there, ready to be used right away. These are the DV Team Builder templates, which means you can't save these layouts directly to your DV library. Instead, you have to download them to your computer and import them using the DV Team Builder. To do so, click the download button. I'm just going to press OK and now I have this particular navigation menu saved to my computer. Next, I'm going to go to DV Team Builder. Here, you just want to click the portability icon and then select the import tab. Before uh, selecting our file, there are a few options here to consider before doing so. It asks you if you would like to override the default website template. If you haven't done anything already in the DV Team Builder, you can leave this checked, it doesn't matter. However, if you have some templates already, make sure to uh, not override your existing work. Uh, so since I don't have anything in the DV Team Builder already, I'm just going to leave these as is and I, I'm just going to select the file I downloaded uh, just a while ago. Finally, click the import button and this is going to add a new template here. As you can see, it is currently unassigned. That means that this header is not uh, displayed anywhere yet. You can click this settings button here and then click manage template assignments and you can assign it to all pages. Alternatively, you can assign it to posts, projects or anywhere else you would like. Or you could just drag and drop this in the first box here. Uh, this is the default website template or the global website templates. By doing so, this template will be automatically shown on every page across your website automatically. I can get rid of this uh, unassigned template here and now I'm just left to save my changes by pressing the save changes button in the top left corner. Uh, here I have a home page with a default header. I'm just going to reload it and we should now see our new navigation. There we go. Let me also click the menu icon. Looks great. These navigation menus that we just added in Ragnar collection are best used with the top level menu items. In other words, if you need to use sub menus, uh, these navigation menus are not the best choice. In that case, you want to check our other navigation menus in the library. That's it for this video. Enjoy.